Now let's draw the graph of function f x is equal to cot x. Cot x is uh, cos x upon sin x. So this function is defined for non-zero values of sin x. Now sin x is zero when x is equal to n pi integral multiple of pi. So domain of function will be domain of uh, function cot x will be all real numbers excluding set of uh, numbers of type n pi where n belongs to set of integers. This is set of values of x for which sin x is zero. In this function, we cannot have sin x is equal to zero, so we are excluding these values of x. Okay. Now to draw the graph of uh, function cot x, we first draw the graph of uh, functions sin x and cos x. Okay. Now consider first quadrant. X belongs to zero to pi by two. We cannot take x is equal to zero because zero is. Uh, a number of type n pi, ठीक है ना? We cannot have integral multiple of pi, तो हम यहाँ पे zero नहीं ले सकते, because sine zero is zero and uh, uh, for sine zero is equal to zero, cortex is not defined. Okay. Now, in first quadrant, cos x function uh, decreases from uh, one to zero, but sine x function increases from uh, zero to one. That means uh, the numerator value is uh, decreasing and denominator value is increasing and both the values are positive so ratio will decrease ratio kya karega decrease karega na at x is equal to pi by 2 value of cot x is 0 cos pi by 2 is 0 sin pi by 2 is 1 so cot pi by 2 is 0 so we have this point on the graph of function cot x okay and when x tends to 0 जब x जीरो को अप्रोच करेगा वी कैन नॉट टेक x इज इक्वल टू एक्जैक्टली जीरो बट वी कैन टेक वैल्यू क्लोज टू जीरो स्लाइटली मोर देन जीरो बिकॉज वी आर इन फर्स्ट क्वार्टर ओके वेन x अप्रोचेज टू जीरो कॉज एक्स अप्रोचेज टू वन एंड साइन एक्स अप्रोचेज टू जीरो बोथ द वैल्यूज आर पॉजिटिव सो टेंस टू वन अपॉन टेंस टू जीरो इज प्लस इन्फिनिटी सो ग्राफ ऑफ फंक्शन इन फर्स्ट क्वार्टर विल बी लाइक दिस to the right of zero graph falls from plus infinity it decreases continuously and uh, takes value zero at pi by 2 theek hai na now consider second quadrant where x belongs to pi by 2 2 pi here sin x is decreasing from 1 to 0 and cos x is uh, decreasing from uh, 0 to minus 1 okay that means here numerator is becoming uh, uh, more negative and uh, denominator is uh, becoming uh, less positive more negative upon less positive means uh, this ratio is decreasing but this ratio will be negative ye ratio decrease to hoga uh, but kya hoga negative hoga वैसे भी second quadrant mein cortex hum jante hain ki negative hota hai and when x approaches to pi value of cos x approaches to minus 1 and uh, value of sin x approaches to Zero. So ratio cos x upon sin x approaches to minus infinity. जब x pi को approach करेगा pi की smaller side से pi की left hand side से तो cos x का value जो है वो minus one को approach करेगा and sin x का value जो है वो zero को approach करेगा. But uh, uh, this value is positive. We write here zero plus. N minus one upon zero plus value approaches to minus infinity. So In the second quadrant, graph of cortex will be like this. It decreases from zero to minus infinity. So here we have graph of function cortex. In the interval zero to pi, the width of this interval is pi units. Here function continuously decreases. Now for cortex function, we know that cot of pi plus x is equal to cot x for all x belongs to uh, domain of function. Okay. That means uh, period of function cortex is pi. Fundamental period of cortex function is also pi. That means uh, in the intervals pi to two pi, and then from two pi to three pi, and so on, uh, we have same graph of function cortex what we have in interval zero to pi. So, we will do what we have in the graph of cortex from zero to pi. We will do the graph of cortex from zero to pi. पाई से टू पाई टू पाई से थ्री पाई देन थ्री पाई से फोर पाई में हम कॉपी करते जाएंगे सो दिस इज द ग्राफ ऑफ फंक्शन कॉटेक्स पीरियड इज पाई डोमेन इज आर माइनस सेट ऑफ नंबर्स ऑफ टाइप एन पाई एन बिलोंग्स टू जेड ओके ना व्हाट इज रेंज ऑफ दिस फंक्शन रेंज रहेगा फंक्शन का रेंज क्या होगा 
where cortex uh, function takes all real values from uh, plus infinity to minus infinity. So, range of function is all real numbers. 10x and cortex ka jo range hai, wo all real numbers hota hai, thik hai na? Really this height is more than this height. So we have log of x2 to the base a greater than log x1 to the base a.